It's one day left to register to vote in Alabama. The American Civil Liberties Union partnered with local farmers to encourage people to vote, but also make sure that their basic needs are met. WSFA reporter Emma Ellis was there and tells us how this event furthers their initiative to get people to the polls. Quickly running out to register to vote in Alabama. That's why the American Civil Liberties Union is working all over the state to make sure people are registered. We realize that there is a great deal of uh, apathy, voter apathy across the state, um, simply because folks just need to be supported for their basic necessities. The ACLU wants to make sure that not only do people show up and show out at the polls, but that all their needs are met and cared for. That's why as a part of their project move, which stands for Making Our Voices Echo, the nonpartisan program held a food drive at Shady Grove Blueberry Patch in Tuskegee, Alabama. But this food drive was unlike any other. The ACLU is supporting us today to um, ensure that the residents have an opportunity to get some fresh food. Fresh food is extremely important to Fresh Greens Market co-founder Erica Washington. Everything is better fresh, and what we know about medicine, food is medicine. So if we want to be living and well and vibrant, we need living and vibrant food. For Tuskegee Concept Biology student Michael Adediji, who moved here from Nigeria just two months ago, seeing this, he says, was a beautiful thing. And most of the things they are giving are natural stuff that can also boost our immune system to fight against some diseases in this society. So that make it more something I'm very happy to be here to just see how things are going. And the best part? Everything there from produce to massage therapy to baked goods and more was completely free. Reporting in Tuskegee, Emma Ellis, WSFA 12 News. And if you need to check your voter registration status, the link to do so is in this story on WSFA.com.